Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Peppa Pig Ice Cream Time. It started to get hot, so I thought this set would be perfect. Also, since it matches the theme, I thought I'd show you this super cool ice cream set by Small World Living. It's an ice cream bonanza today! Let's open up the Peppa Pig set first. Here's the lovely Peppa Pig, ready to sell some ice cream. She's got a scooper and a yellow apron on. She also looks dressed for the summer. And here's George in his cool little dinosaur outfit. It looks like he's trying to beat the heat too. You can also twist his arms and move his legs. Now George is sitting down. Oh nice, we can even move his head. And here's the ice cream cart that Peppa Pig will be pushing. It looks really hip. Oh, that's a bummer. It looks like we can't open this up though. Come and get it! Ice cream! Ice cream! Who wants some ice cream? Me, 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 me. Okay, George. I'll actually make you something better from the super cool ice cream set. Yay! Let's open the second set up so we can help Peppa Pig. We get an ice cream scooper. This one's a lot bigger compared to Peppa Pig's. Here's a double scooped ice cream cone. We got a mint ice cream and a strawberry ice cream. It's really easy to put on too. Pretty simple, right? We get another ice cream cone, and this one has chocolate flavor on it. And here are some specialty ice creams. The right one is mint chocolate, and the left one is strawberry shortcake. All the ice creams stick nicely into the scooper so that you can place it onto the cup or the cone. And here are the two ice cream cups. They look pretty cute. See? Okay, George. What flavor would you like? I want chocolate. I want mint. I want uh, um strawberry. Um ice cream. Ice cream, ice cream. Okay, George, calm down. You can have it all. Let's help Peppa Pig give all the ice cream to George. Here's a single scoop of mint chocolate. Oh, it looks like George wants a chocolate scoop on top too. There you go, George. Here's your first ice cream. Now he wants a mint ice cream in a cup. Are you sure you can eat all this, George? His stomach is endless. Now he wants an ultimate strawberry scoop, which is the strawberry ice cream and the strawberry shortcake ice cream. Here you go, George. Mm, yummy, 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 yummy. My gosh, George, I can't believe you ate that all. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Oh, just another reminder. Be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Peppa Pig Picnic Adventure Car. Cool, you can press that Peppa Pig button for melodies, phrases, and oinks.
that was fun! This set also comes with a picnic blanket! And here's Peppa Pig in her picnic attire! She has some nice heart sunglasses! We also get a picnic basket! You can flip it around to fill the basket with food! It looks like Peppa Pig wants to go for a drive! Now let's open up this Peppa Pig, Peppa and Family figure set. We'll need this so that the whole family can go on a picnic. Here's Daddy Pig. We get another Peppa Pig. Here's George! And here's Mummy Pig! Now it's time for the whole family to get in the car! Peppa Pig and her family needed to stop by the store before they go on their picnic. Mummy and Daddy Pig are shopping from the vending machine. It looks like they got a watermelon. And a hamburger. That'll be great for the picnic. Peppa Pig and George are shopping at the bakery. They got a pretzel! And a cheesecake! Yummy desserts for the picnic! <laughs> that was a fun picnic with Peppa Pig and her family! Thanks for watching! Please subscribe to watch more! See you soon! Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Plants vs Zombies, Zombie Ooze. This should be really fun! Here's what this set provides. And this is what we'll be doing with the ooze. Let's start by opening up our set. Here's the zombie ooze. And here's the zombie that they provide. It's really squishy. And here's where we can place our ooze. Let's see what this zombie ooze looks like.
Whoa, this is really cool. This reminds me of the slime video. This ooze is really fun to play with. Let's place it back in the container. Cool. Now it's time to place the ooze in the zombie. Let's squeeze and watch what happens. This is disgustingly awesome. Our zombie is crying tears of ooze. Cool. The zombie has more ooze coming out from his other eye. It looks like the plants won this time. Thanks for watching Awesome Disney Toys. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Play-Doh, Angry Birds, Build and Smash. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. We'll be mixing Angry Birds and Play-Doh at the same time. This should be really fun. Let's start by opening up the box. Here's the launcher and the base for the launcher. This is the base for the towers. And here's some of the Play-Doh that they provide. Here's some more Play-Doh. Nice, we get more Play-Doh. And here's an Angry Bird box that we can knock down. It also acts as a mold. And here are some more tools for our playset. Here's another box that we can make molds with. We can make Chuck and Redbird. Here's King Pig. And this is Chuck. He's also a roller. And here's the original red Angry Bird. It also acts as a stamp.
Here's the base for the launcher. It has some molds that we can create. The launcher is very easy to assemble. Cool. And here's all the Play-Doh that they provide. Let's start by using this green box to make some Minion Piggies. We'll use this green Play-Doh. Here's our first minion pig. That looks cool. Let's make another one. These look perfect! We'll make some more. Nice! Here are five minion piggies. Let's decorate them some more. Our minion piggies are ready to be knocked down. Let's use this blue Play-Doh to make the Blues Angry Birds. This one can't wait to launch. We'll decorate it some more. That looks really good! Here's Jim, Jake, and Jay, the blues. Now let's use this red box to make the original red bird and the yellow angry bird, Chuck. We'll start with red bird. He looks fierce. Let's decorate it some more. Here are the twin angry redbirds. They can't wait to get launched. 
Now let's make Chuck. He looks really fierce too. Let's decorate him as well. He's ready to go. We can also use this red Angry Bird to make some more piggy stamps. Here's a yellow piggy, a green piggy, a red piggy, and a blue piggy. The yellow Angry Bird Chuck also acts as a roller. That looks really cool. We can also use the Play-Doh cans and the boxes so that we can create a tower to knock down. We can't forget our minion piggies. Our tower is complete. Now it's time for the birds to knock this down. I can't wait. We'll launch one of the blue birds, the angry red bird, and the angry yellow bird at the same time. Nice! That was three stars! The second shot was really good too! This was really fun! Thanks for watching Awesome Disney Toys! Please subscribe to watch more! See you soon! Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Play-Doh Animal Activities Bucket. We'll be making some cool animals today. What's your favorite animal? I'd love to hear it. Alright, let's see what's inside now. Here's a cow. This is a giraffe. Here's an alligator, a horse, a butterfly, this is a dolphin, here's a duck, we get an elephant, and we get a rabbit. We also get to play with red and brown Play-Doh and green and purple Play-Doh. Let's start by using the red Play-Doh. Since we're making these animals, I keep thinking about the zoo. I've only gone once in my life, and it was okay. I was really excited to see a bald eagle, but the eagle was hiding so I couldn't really see him. We'll first create this butterfly.
Here's our red butterfly. Let's decorate this butterfly a little more. I think this purple Play-Doh will make this butterfly more unique. Let's make the butterfly a little more funkier and add some green to it. I guarantee you've never seen a butterfly like this before. Let's make another animal. If you could be any animal, what would you be? I'm not sure what animal I'd be, but I'm gonna say tiger, cause they're pretty cool. Well, let's make a cow now. He's alive! We'll give him some purple eyes. And I'll add some red dots. He kinda looks like an evil cow. What do you think? Now let's make an animal with this green Play-Doh. We'll make an alligator. Remember guys, if you ever see one of these, be sure to run as fast as you can. Let's give this alligator some eyes. I think I'm accidentally making too many evil animals today. We'll use this purple Play-Doh and make a nice little duck. So far, so good! <laughs> I think this is an alien duck now. Alright, for this Play-Doh, I stretched it out really long. Can you guess which animal it is? Yep, it's a giraffe. I wish I could see a green giraffe in real life. That'd be pretty cool. Let's give this giraffe some life. Is it just me, or do all my animals look really evil today? Alright, there's no way we can mess up on this bunny. Bunnies are supposed to be cute and fluffy. Let's design it. This one turned out nice and sweet. 
Now let's make an elephant. I think we'll make this elephant look kind too. There we go. That's a cute elephant. Now let's make a horse. Let's see how this horse turns out once we decorate it. It kind of looks like a donkey too. Here's a quick memory game. We're on our last animal. Can you guess which one it is? If you guess dolphin, you have the greatest memory in the world. Good job. Let's decorate our last animal. He looks a little sad because this show is almost over. Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here. And today we're bringing you Play-Doh Beach Creations Bucket. We'll be having some fun in the sun today. You should definitely give a thumbs up if you like going to the beach. Let's see what we find inside this bucket. We get a starfish mold a lobster mold, a shovel, we can also make a footprint, we get a bucket, we can use this to create a fish, and here's the fish's tail. Here's a roller, we also get some extruders, we can make sea plants. We also get a knife. We get a blue and red Play-Doh. A yellow Play-Doh. And here's the special sand textured Play-Doh compound. Hopefully it feels just like real sand. This looks interesting. Let's shovel it out and see how it feels. This definitely feels like the sand you would find at the beach. This Play-Doh sand is pretty awesome. Now that we have all the sand out, let's start forming our beach. We have our sand done, now let's use the blue Play-Doh to make our ocean. Do you guys like going to the beach? 
If so, let me know what your favorite activity is. I like to make really big sandcastles. Cool! Here are the waves hitting the sand. Now that our beach is set up, let's create some sea creatures. We'll start by using the red play-doh. I'll create a lobster first. Here's our red lobster. Let's give the lobster some eyes. Let's design the lobster a little more. Let's place the lobster right there. Now let's use the yellow play-doh to make some more sea creatures. This time we'll make a starfish. Can't forget the eyes! Let's place the starfish right there! Now it's time for us to make some sea plants! Let's make a red sea plant! That looks really pretty! Sea plants go underneath the ocean, so let's place it right there. We'll make one more. This time, it'll be a yellow sea plant. Our beach is looking really nice! Let's add some footprints on the sand! And we can't forget about the bucket! We'll need that to make our sand castle! Now let's make our fish! We'll give it a red body! This is one unique looking fish! We'll have it swim in the ocean! It looks like our fish swam away! Well this was a lot of fun! Thanks for watching! Please subscribe to watch more! See you soon!
everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we'll be learning the colors of the rainbow by making a Play-Doh rainbow. Hopefully, this video will help you learn what colors are in the rainbow and where each color goes. The color that's on the very top of the rainbow is red. I'm sure some of you know this, but if you don't, all you need to do is memorize this acronym and you'll know where each color goes. It's Roy G. Biv. Since R is the first letter, we put red on top. The next letter is O, so that means it's orange. Can you guys tell me something that's orange? I'm gonna go with pumpkin. It's gonna be Halloween in a couple months. Are you guys excited? If so, give this video a thumbs up. The third letter in Roy G. Biv is Y, which means the third color is yellow. Now who can tell me something that's yellow? I'm gonna say sunflower, because they're pretty. Since we finished Roy, now it's on to G, and G stands for green. You know how they say you can find the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow? Well, there's actually someone else there too, and it's green. If you guessed Leprechaun, you're right! High five! Now let's move on to the B in Biv, which is blue. Alright, I'm thinking of something blue, and it makes up most of this earth. Can you guess what it is? If you said ocean, ding ding ding, you're correct! Time to move on to the eye in Biv. This is indigo. What's something that's an indigo color? Write it in the comments below. And the last color of the rainbow is violet. Violet's a pretty color. Alright, now it's time to make the rainbow. We'll start with R. O. Y. G. B. I. And V. Roy G. Biv. If you guys remember that, you'll never forget what colors are in the rainbow. I'll add some white clouds to make the rainbow prettier. Okay, let's see if you remember Roy G. Biv. Red. Orange. Yellow. Green. Blue. Indigo and violet. Woohoo! You guys know all the colors of the rainbow now. Well, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to watch more. See you soon. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone! Uh, some Disney toys here, and today I'm super excited to bring you another rainbow activity. This time we're gonna make an actual rainbow. All we need is a cutting tool and some Play-Doh. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and white. We'll start with the purple first. 
We just roll it up like this. That looks good to me. And now we're going to do our blue. Time for the green one. Now yellow. You can see that each color gets bigger and bigger because we're going to layer them on top of each other. Here's our orange one. And last but not least, red. This is going to be the longest one. All right. So now we take the purple one and we bend it like this. And then we bend the blue one right on top. Followed by the green one and the yellow. And then orange. And then red. And now we're going to use our cutting tool to clean up the ends. But what's a rainbow without clouds? I'm going to make some. First, let's make a base for it. Just like this. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. And then to make our clouds, we're going to roll more white play-doh like this. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. And then we're going to press it down. There's one cloud. And here's another one. Don't they look so fluffy? Let's lay this one on the right side. And then this one on the left side. Hmm, and for some added fun, let's make the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. All we need is some black Play-Doh, and we'll use some of the leftover yellow Play-Doh we have. Let's mold our black Play-Doh into kind of like a pear shape. And then we press it down. We'll just cut off the top. And we'll roll it up. This will be the opening of the pot. Now let's fill it up with gold! I'm going to roll up little pieces of yellow Play-Doh and stack them on top of each other. We do this till our pot of gold is full. And here's everything we made today. This was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to see more. Thanks. Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below. Hey everyone. Uh, some Disney toys here. And I hope you're hungry, because today I'm bringing you Play-Doh Breakfast Cafe. Here's the front of the box. Look at all this fun stuff we can make. Here's the back of the box. Yum, waffles! I can't wait to get started. Let's open it up to see what's inside. Here's a bag of accessories. Hmm, not sure what this is yet. I guess we'll just have to find out. Some instructions. And here's everything else. So 
So this is to dispense our whipped cream. Let's see what's in this bag. Here's our waffle press. And it also has some molds on top. We just clip this right in here. Whoa, look at it move. And this set comes with four cans of Play-Doh. We have white Play-Doh Plus, blue Play-Doh, yellow, and pink. I can't wait to see what's in this bag of accessories. We have a knife, a serving plate, an extruder, this goes right in here. Ooh, look at this waffle mold. A fork. A spatula. And molds for our extruder. Here's the instructions. It shows us how to put everything together. On top of this press is more molds. Yum, looks like there's some fruit on there. And on the pan we have two egg molds. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day, so let's get started. I think we should start with some eggs. I like my eggs sunny side up. We're gonna put a little bit of the yellow Play-Doh to make the yolk, and the rest we'll use white. Let me know in the comments how you guys like your eggs. Yum, this egg looks good. Let's put it on our plate. Sometimes I like my eggs scrambled. So let's do eggs two ways. We just press it down into our mold. That looks good. That's a healthy breakfast. Now let's make a waffle plate. I'm really excited to use this waffle press. We just roll up some yellow Play-Doh into a ball. And then put it in our press. Now let's press down. That turned out great. Let's use our spatula to take it out. I'm using a plate from a different set. Let's do more waffles. Yummy! I think it needs one more. How many of you guys like waffles for breakfast? Give this video a thumbs up if you do! Yum! I think our waffle needs some toppings. How about some whipped cream? Let's get some white Play-Doh and put it in our extruder. 
Play-Doh Plus is softer, making it perfect for whipped cream. Let's take our waffles and put it right under it. And then squeeze. Mmm, look at how fluffy that whipped cream looks. Hmm, I think our waffles still need something. How about some fruit on top? I'm thinking strawberry. Let's take some pink Play-Doh and put it into our mold. And let's do some blueberry too. You can't go wrong with a lot of fruit. Let me know in the comments what toppings you like on your waffles. Now let's take our strawberry and our blueberry and put it on top of our waffles. Yum, sweet and healthy. Let's make some fruit on the side. Here's a banana. Bananas are a great source of potassium. And now let's make an orange. Oranges have a lot of vitamin C. Let's use our last mold. I love fruit for breakfast. This one's a melon. And here's our fruity waffles. Mmm, I'm craving some waffles now. Let's try out using this tool. One of my favorite things for breakfast is bacon. I think we should make